Well, it's been almost six months since the city launched a program to help reduce the amount of trash on Chinatown sidewalks. Is it working? Max Rodriguez went to Chinatown to find out. Well, business owners in Chinatown tell me the trash situation is better with these yellow trash bags, but they do see some areas of improvement. Business owners and shoppers say the streets of Chinatown were like a dumpster, but not anymore. You know, before, uh, you know, the baggage and then the people walk around, the smell really bad, and then the people don't come to my business. Since last fall, the city has been asking businesses to use these yellow plastic bags. They're thicker than usual, and the cost comes to about 60 cents a piece. The goal is to keep waste off the curb and people from tearing into them. I think it brought awareness that it was a critical situation where we had mountains of trash. And um, with the expanded uh, signing up of more customers, that solved the issue. Still, not all solutions are perfect. Alice, who runs a fresh produce shop, says the bags could be difficult to handle. The bag is very good to use. But if the only thing is um, hard to tie it up tight. This business owner tells me that the mandate is working, yet there are some problems, such as people who are not paying for the service, dumping their trash where they're not supposed to. If, uh, if anything can do, have a sign to say, this area yeah. is uh, the trash only for this store only. Mm. Yeah, it's more better for, for me, you know. For now, they've installed cameras outside to catch them in the act. The deputy director of environmental services says they are considering locked carts to keep the trash out of unwanted hands. And for now, there are no plans to expand to other parts of the city. Max Rodriguez, K-22 News, working for Hawaii.